out here recording guns. We have a great arsenal of different types of guns and we're going to be picking up the sound via very a very nice array of different uh, microphones with different characteristics. Some specializing in the bass and the low end, some getting the high end and some good all-around mid-range mics. It gives us the opportunity to actually have fine control on the, the weapons that we have. When we have this opportunity to do it ourselves, we can set it up so that we're getting exactly the content that we want. Microphones are kind of like people in the sense that they have different personalities and microphones are ears and each microphone hears things in a totally different way. It perceives the sound it's picking up in a different way. And so by having 10 different microphones, we're getting that same gunshot coming through in 10 different perspectives. With all that together, it just creates a very realistic sonic experience. Actually seeing and being here, like a 50 cal when it goes off, it really can't be explained. You actually have to be there to see it. It kind of puts a whole new perspective on some of the sound design choices that we're going to be making on top of the fact that we get all these really great sounds captured now for our own personal library to use. It's hugely beneficial from a philosophical and direct sound design concept. We use that source material kind of like a painter does with a palette of colors. Using these sound recordings, we can go back into our studio and have a palette of sounds to work from. Ah! This is a Les Bear Custom SRP 1911 45 handgun. It's very accurate, very reliable. 1911 handgun has been used for World War II all the way up to today. This is a Smith & Wesson 500 Magnum, one of the largest production made handguns. It will pretty much take down any animal in North America and most of them in Africa. This is a Mossberg 500 12 gauge short barrel shotgun. You've got a pistol grip and a very short barrel, so it's very compact and you basically shoot from the hip with it. Okay. This is M16 223, used all over the world by police and military. It has a project on, scope on top. It's a real nice weapon. This is a M60, shoots a 308 762 full auto machine gun. Nicknamed is the Pig. It was used in Vietnam. This is a Barrett, 50 caliber. Takes a 10 round box magazine, semi-automatic. It was originally made to take out vehicles. You could take this, shoot it through an engine block, and it'll zip right through uh, like it's going through paper. 